One of the most popular peptides that we sell today in all of our locations across the country is our Ipamorelin CJC IGF-1 peptide blend. Now, the beautiful thing about this peptide blend is it doesn't negatively affect the pituitary gland. To give you an idea or a better understanding of how Ipamorelin CJC and IGF-1 work is this. We basically give yourself an injection subcutaneously, small, a little bit, a little dose, and what that does is it stimulates the pituitary gland to secrete more growth hormone. So you're gonna be using a small needle like this, so you're gonna be putting it into your stomach, squeezing your fat, and putting it into your fat. And what that's gonna do is it's going to signal the pituitary gland to secrete growth hormone. But what it's not gonna do is tell the pituitary gland to stop producing growth hormone. One of the most common issues with real growth hormone, or uh, I guess you could say omnitrope, genotropin, all of those things is once start once you start taking real HGH, your pituitary gland signals itself to shut off because it's already getting the amount needed from the drug. Now that's the total opposite of what this is going to do. This is just going to help your body encourage the pituitary gland to secrete more of what it's good at doing. So you're not going to have any lo negative long-term side effects. And with this specific peptide, with the IGF-1 in it, what, what growth hormone is, the end result of growth hormone is IGF-1, which is produced in your liver. So now you're getting the best effects of growth hormone with all the positive side effects of growth hormone with none of the negative effects of growth hormone. We've seen this blend give IGF-1 levels very similar to what real growth hormone does on our patient's blood work for over three years. And we highly, highly recommend this blend for all males and females that come into our offices.